it's not quite when Harry met Sally. As you certainly know, there's been a flood of investor money, notably private equity money, into many medical specialties over the last decade or so. Uh, depending on what medical specialty you're in, private equity investment is just beginning to ramp up. For example, I'm seeing both here at the law firm and at our M&A advisory firm, Steering Advisors LLC, an uptick in deals in dermatology, ophthalmology, and orthopedic surgery. To use a sports analogy, in some medical specialties, the game is just getting started. There are many factors that make your medical practice an attractive candidate for private equity investment, but that's not what I want to talk about with you today. Instead, it's essential, whether or not you ever plan on doing a private equity deal, to know what makes a practice completely unattractive to any buyer. That's potential compliance problems, in particular, potential violations of the federal anti-kickback statute and of Stark. Too many physicians approach compliance from the who's going to know, the, the how they're going to know perspective. As I've written many times in the past, you'd be surprised, such as one of your partners or even an employee in your own billing office. But here in the mergers and acquisitions context, the how has an actual name. It's called due diligence, the investigation of the quality of the to-be-acquired entity that includes a near proctological look into potential compliance issues. The presence of unresolved compliance issues can easily result in a dead deal. And even if it doesn't, the representations and warranties, the risk allocation provisions of the acquisition deal will shift responsibility for undisclosed pre-closing compliance issues back onto you, the seller. In other words, that planned trip to a faraway tourist district might be swapped for an unplanned trip to district court. Whether you're interested in a potential sale of your practice now, in the future, or never, the first step is always the same and should be taken immediately. Commission a red team, a self-sponsored deep dive into your own group's compliance risks today.